Hello, this is Scrafty Scrafty, and today we are playing another episode of Great Tech New Horizons Season 2. And if you can see, we have another room here. And I kind of sort of did something. Uh, steam grinders. A few, yeah. And steam hatches. Steam hatch. Input pass, output pass. But uh, there is one per two machines. And because if they are acting as any other uh, multi block machine in Great Tech, they should share one. And I'm going to take this little guy with me. It's going to take a while. And now we just need to place everything right like this. And one more steam patch. And you should be this way. And rest is just chasing. And voila! We have. And yeah, they are all <laughs> uh, finny. Uh, actually, I can add one more. And if I move things a bit, one block to this side, I can actually add two more. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, should I do that? Nah, it's gonna be overkill. Over, but I'm symmetry is it's off putting so and yeah that look that looks much much better and everything is chunk aligned so nothing to worry I actually can't wait a second I think I can see yeah, it's a better way of uh, detecting ore chunks. Okay, good to know. That's good to know. I didn't realize that before. And Pachi decides to run for a marathon. And as you can see, all of them are valid multi-blocks. And I forgot to orient you. Now, what we're going to need to do is move our steam production here. And our water sources are ready and our power is done. No problem, no problem. Uh, that happens a lot, actually, by the way. Either this or I should move to biodiesel. I have to make one more. Actually, two, uh, three more. But anyway, I love how Great Tech Pipes uh, manages the sides. By the way, it's uh, really logical. Okay, we have steam production again, and with that, we also have a super tank that connected here. And its output is... Oh, by the way, why did I put one level below? Because I'm planning to add a redstone control in the future, maybe. Or not. I don't know. Actually, wait a second. I can add the redstone control from here, too. And this time, it shouldn't be much of a uh, thing. I need to, to carry some uh, milks or at least get the Terra Ward. And if I do this, sorry, do this and do it at all. Yes, our steam machines are operational again. And let's do. Where was it? I can get. Which ore should I process first uh, for testing? Let's do Galena. 
Uh, let's do a for uh, one stack of Galena. I hope it recognizes. Those two should work together. One works, the other. Okay, the other also works. Yeah, both work. Both work. Both uses the same Steam input, same uh, thing, image input, and same everything. But our Steam production might not cut, so we might add more Steam production to carry all four of them. Also, the furnaces. But yeah, uh, this part is actually quite cool. And quite fast. <laughs> yeah, uh, we are still not bo gonna bother with our uh, Universal Misterator. Uh, the byproducts are good, but it's not be all, a be all and end all of everything. And we're gonna move this fella. Hello, Enderman. And goodbye, Enderman. And we got an achievement. And a quest, sorry. Okay, uh, by the way, I doubled the size of our crushers. Uh, what I'm planning to do is this side is for the ores and this side is for the crushed ores. So, yeah. And one more thing. Uh, for... Yeah. I'm going to do that. And because I decided two different ways of doing things, but end up doing with logistics pipes would be much better and much more on brand for me. But, by the way, yes, uh, we're going to use logistics pipes, but we crafted a logistics item. And I need those guys. Because what I want is... Uh, you cannot see here at the moment, but... Yep, item filter... Uh, type filter item sync module. This is what I want. This is what I need. Before that, we need to hunt some meteors. We already have one meteor uh, dog, and it gave us the silicon one. The meteor we dog was here. And I'm just going to need to search for the others. And we found another meteor. So, let's dig it. And let's hope it's not the si Okay, I think we found the jackpot. Oh yes, some ropes. Can I do that? Yep. And there's one more. Whoops. I feel like an attack helicopter. And the last one. Yeah, we should get the quest. Okay, this opens now. And we got the quest. Now we just need to do those guys. By the way, one set is ready, so actually we can do something like that. Redstone. 24 redstone. We're gonna need that. That much redstone. And... Thank you, and I'm gonna take this. Kill two of those, because I need to put the, these guys too. And close the fluid auto output, and get our Molten Redstone. And with that, we will make our first... Uh, these guys. Yeah, let's start with these guys. And... Thank you. Do you need... Any circuit number? No, you don't. So, let's make this the assembler. Be all one of my uh, one of the best machines in the game. 
And with that, we should have this quest. Yes. Uh, I won't continue with the others, because we cannot continue with the Light Energy 6 at the moment. It's beyond us. Beyond reality. Anyway, uh, that was a good pack, by the way. CK. Okay, I have to use Fluid Canner. Do I have any Fluid Canner? I think I don't have any Fluid Canner. Chemical bag. Did I make? Yeah, I guess I didn't make. Fluid can. Yep. Uh, we didn't make fluid canner, guys. Uh, that's an oversight on my end. But I guess fluid canner is easy. So let me just do that and fill our can. And 30k coolant. Yeah, that part is ready. And we also need molten copper and one electrical circuit. Okay, now everything is ready. And like steel bolt. You, 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 and also what else do we need? Medium voltage circuit. And soldering alloy. And voila, my filter. And let's do this. If I put this, yeah, it's a dust. And if I add this to the filter, yeah, it now filters dusts. Yeah, this is how the type filter works. What I'm planning to do is. I get ores, ores will be here, and then I will get crushed ores, here. Uh, but some types are going to be different, uh, especially the ones I'm going to put on sifting machine and thermal centrifuge. They will be different. After that, it's also I need one more set of type filter too. Because we're gonna need a filter for uh, purified and non purified uh, ores too. Uh, not dust, yeah. Uh, impure and purified. So, yeah. It's fun. It's really fun, guys. Actually, come to think of it. Yeah, we need, we need. And we will use a lot of extractor upgrades. Yeah, it's fun. Okay. Anyway, uh, currently I am a bit tired, and actually let me just continue when I have a bit time, and we will finish the episode after I did the logic here. Okay, uh, this place feels more and more empty. Because it is, it's getting emptier and emptier and emptier and emptier. Uh, by the way, my long-term plan is demolish this part, build a normal-looking, a an actual house-looking house, and it more more in a gothic style, and make it our magical area. Uh, maybe move to this side a bit. So, yeah, uh, probably around this area. Come and make it our magical house of wisdom. Oh, and yeah. Uh, anyway, <laughs> as you can see, I removed every machine from here. Uh, currently, the, we the, do not have any machine here. No, not steam ones, not uh, electrical ones. We only have these, and this guy still uses steam for energy, but we will uh, change it. Anyway, let's go there. Also, I put the low voltage assembly here just for the cables and arc furnace here. 
And Steam Extractor here. Uh, the St Steam Squisher, sorry. Anyway, come to here. We have a strange area. It's not fully finished yet. Uh, we will expand to here with a lot of uh, centrifuges. But yeah, uh, we have a water line here for these simple washers. Simple washers are uh, exactly what the uh, what it does is when we put uh, dirty ores in the crucible uh, cauldron with water. So yeah, it washes them. I do, did not use uh, ore washers because they are slow, and we are currently not uh, worried about the byproducts. If I need an ore with a specific byproduct, I will add an ore washing plan, uh, ore washer, and I will uh, route that to the system. Okay. Now, let's look at... By the way, I didn't uh, put all the modules yet. And I think my... Ah, it's here. I put on charging. Anyway, uh, let's look at the... I put this one. This crushes ores. Just ores. And these crushes crushed ores. Yes. But for, for some crushed ores, I want them to be washed. Uh, the one of the biggest one is lapis, and I'm going to put the crushed lapis here. Yeah, and and let's look at it. If I put the crushed lapis here. It doesn't happen anything because we didn't ex put extractor module yet. By the way, I made a Mark III extractor module, which requires a diamond upgrade, which requires a gold upgrade, and which requires a four or clock upgrade. So yeah, <laughs> and two high voltage circuits. Uh, so it's a, and as you can see. Yeah, they go there, because it's the default road. And... Okay, I think I need to put on a round robin, okay. I will put it on round robin, but... It ended up purified here. <laughs> okay, that's something. That's something interesting. And... Let's put another extractor module here, but I want to upgrade that extractor module too, so let's do that. And it's quite simple, by the way. I just need to do this. Yeah. And I also want to put this guy. Uh, in, by washing it gives me... A uh, centrifusion, actually, centrifusion, it gives me lead, but it's not important. By the way, I put a Mark IV chassis pipe here, uh, because I will probably sort a lot of things. So here, I want it to be all manual, and as you can see, they all go here, and they... Uh, went cooking and extractor mark 3 is ready and if I put extractor mark 3 to this guy everything get cooked went here actually I can use extractor mark 2 on this yeah I can use extractor mark 2 because it's not going to be that much faster and Mark II is much more cheaper. And we can use Extractor Mark III on something else. Something completely different. So yeah, that would be a better way of doing it. Extractor Mark II. 
Okay. And I will have to pull pull you and extractor mark two module. Okay. That should be enough. Yeah, it's not much faster than uh, these machines uh, working. So it's a bit slower, but it's still much faster. That uh, it's still enough. Maybe a bit more uh, backlogging, but it will work. Also, let's process these guys. And yeah, they are feeling with in round robin passion, and I think I need to put an upgrade to this guy. Yeah, I need a speed upgrade. <laughs> uh, but it will work, and as you can see, everything c goes there. And this guy will work. Actually, I I should use mark. Three or not? Uh, I will just uh, I will just look at it and decide on which one should work. Also, let's for example crash magnetite. By the way, I can directly cook you, or I can use fairy leaf. Actually, should I use fairy leaf with it? Nah, uh, I. By the way, do you the purified one? No, uh, I still gonna require normal ones, but uh, currently I do not have its own full capacity. So, should I crush you? I uh, I don't need to crush you actually. I can just put you in here. Whoops. Let's do this. And you will be cooked. Yeah. And the buffer is not going to last long, but actually, let's just add one more of this guy. Uh, I will probably add a move to electric uh, smelter uh, just a short while after that. But. Okay, steam furnace, a uh, steam oven. Okay, you need a high pressure furnace, which requires this. So let's get the materials, and I think I need two sets. Yeah, I need two sets. One, and the second. Ah, I need. Uh, bronze plate. Okay, bronze plate. Let's make 64. By the way, the system works. I need Mark 3. I definitely need Mark 3. Mark 2 is good, but Mark 3 is better. Yeah, definitely need Mark 3. But it works. Okay. Also, let's get yeah, wh where was it? Ah, here. No, I didn't uh, crush uh, plated them yet. Okay, as you can see, uh, a lot of things are just uh, crushed cinnabar. Cinnabar. Should I just use you like this, or should I or wash you? If I or wash you, I can put it in sifter and it would be actually much better. Uh, so, Cinnabar, you also go there. And if I put Cinnabar or to here, it goes there. Okay. And Cryolite, you're processing. Uh, you do alumina dust on but yeah i can just crush 
and Centrifuge. Uh, actually, Crush and Wash you. So, yeah. Uh, Macerator A and Centrifuge. If I can, I. Uh, simple Lust, what should I add? Yeah. If I put you here. I will have to do that, and Crash Cryolite will be macerated, and then we will have this guy. And if I put, put this to here, yes, we can do that, by the way. This should go there. Uh, I didn't start it. Yeah, those guys. I put them on hold because I was do some maintenance. And when they macerated, yeah, it's almost ready. And yeah, they go here. They start macerating and I think I should put those on round robin too. Uh, no, 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 I don't need to put on round robin because it's only one input. So, yeah. They are macerating, and after those guys also macerate, they will go here. And they will... It's super fun. <laughs> guys, it's super fun. I really love this. <laughs> I really enjoy this now. Anyway, uh... Well, that's enough with the childish joy, and let me just do this and add more furnaces to our system. Okay, this is ready, and we need to do this. And if I... Steam Furnace! Ah, yeah, we need to do this first. Most likely, yes. A furnace and small bronze fluid pipe. Okay. More bronze. Let's get 14 for now. And furnace. How to make what how should I make the furnace itself? Nah, just do this. One, two. Okay. And if I do this small pipe. Thank you. By the way, I love how uh, small and tiny pipes are super fast. And... Two furnaces, and... Yes. Most likely. And then... Not this, but this. Most likely done. Okay. Uh, I need two raw fire plates and so raw fire, come here. I'm gonna need some plate and some pipes. With you small, okay. Uh, let's make thirty two and small pipe. One, two, three, four, five. Was it five? Yeah. Five, it was five. Whoops. Uh, you didn't see that. Anyway, let's come here. Yeah, it should be okay. And. Okay, they are coming, and voila. And what we need is now. I'm pretty sure boiler tank. No, we don't have any, and. Fireball casing, we also don't have any. Okay, how I will just do that, and as you can see, uh, we are just handling things like this. Uh, and at the end, uh, we will connect the last output to our actual network, and then uh, I will add a sifting, a sifting system here, uh, probably here. A, a huge amount of centrifuges. 
here, here and some electrolyzers here. And they will just do their things. Uh, for example, they will... Uh, actually, should I... Yeah, actually, they can do that, and we will get fluorine. Uh, I have... A... Also, after I move to a high voltage, I can just get... Uh, aluminium from the carbon. Uh, carbon and uh, alumina. And let's look at it. Alumina dust. Alumina dust and... Yeah, uh, actually, no. no. Ah, yeah. Carbon, alumina. Actually, I can do that now. Now, I have uh, output, and with that, I can just uh, re take some of the carbon. So, yeah, I'll, uh, yeah, yeah, I will probably move to that. So, we will <laughs> electrolyze our cryolite. And it will give us fluorine, which is important. And sodium. Sodium is also uh, nice to have. And we are using sodium for our batteries. I'm not bothering with lithium ones because they are not that important. I'm using batteries as small buffers. And yeah, when I need huge amounts of energy, I will probably move to La Patronic Thingy Magigis. So yes, what we are going to do add is add one more uh, furnace here for now, and it will run like hell. And so let's look at our thingies. Can I look at the steamy part? Yeah, you are not that uh, holding that much. We, we need to add. Yeah, we need to add a few more uh, boilers. Yeah, but... It, oh, they are... They calcified. Okay. That's the reason. They calcified. And I think I, uh, they can do their work for a while. Yeah, we have a buffer, a really nice amount of buffer, and when they get uh, heat up, so yeah, we are okay. Anyway, uh, this should be the end of the episode, as the, hey, the basic uh, system is ready, we just need to add the centrifuges, and the centrifuges will be added in the same uh, way by this, and we made a lot of spaghetti. Uh, by the way, I designed this area in mind of the, having two uh, set, uh, two sets of uh, furnaces, uh, the multi smelter. Yeah. So yeah, this is Scripty Scripty, and have a nice day.